we're seeing right now is an entire class of eighth graders that are creating content for our teachers in the building. I wanted to put them in a real world situation. So they have to interview a teacher about what we could possibly create that would make a lesson more visual and easier for students to understand. Um, they all went into an individual teacher interview. Then we came back and got in design groups. Here, go figure out how this works, make it work. This person wants something done with that, go make, put these pieces together and make it work. I think that's about as real world as they can get. If we put the film right here and you put it on, you can see the VR through here as it would look if we pressed play on it there. Yeah, like you would see this sort of stuff. Like this, except in VR. tell quite a bit about how much we progressed just based on like the first one that we made and then this last one we got quite a bit better and we're starting to work on the next teacher project and that one is we're doing good we've learned a lot so yeah, it's got a lot much. easier so what's in this next one it's, uh, cells. it's mine so we have to make a cell plant animal cell right. one of the students in the group came and interviewed me and asked me what i needed out of this project what was my dream what did i want it to look like and i gave them uh, just some starting points. Uh, eventually I got to go and see it for myself. And they asked for honest feedback. They didn't want me to just tell them that they were doing a good job, but they wanted to truly know what they could improve upon. And I think that that's so important because as they go into the real world, they'll, they'll have to interact with clients and, and uh, they got real world experience with that business side. Of